What's up YouTube? Today I'm going to show you how to make your videos look better. Like right now you can tell uh, this is like a in 4.3 because like uh, it's not widescreen but I actually do have a widescreen monitor but this is for those of you who don't have a widescreen monitor and a kind of slow computer. So like you see you have to run it 800 by 600 or you can't go all the way up to 1280 by 720 so like if you have to run it in this that's fine I'm showing you how to make it look in full widescreen so you just leave it like this uh, 800 by 600 do the aspect ratio in standard because if you don't have a widescreen computer then uh, it'll just look weird uh, you can like if you do have widescreen then uh, then you go ahead and leave it 16 by 9 and then if your computer can handle it 1280 by 720 but this is for those who can't so 800 by 600 and then on standard 4 by 3 and then you can leave it like this uh, you just turn all this stuff off make it tiny so your computer doesn't process that much spec map uh, some maps need it for uh, some mods like the armory it just depends. You can uh, adjust the brightness, whatever. This is what I keep it at. And then texture settings. You can go here, make it uh, low. Go to you click manual, and you make everything go low, and you just uh, apply that. Anyway, um, so yeah, and then you just record normally like that. All right. Uh, let me go ahead and go on my desktop. Okay, YouTube. So uh, you see here when you record a gameplay, when you see it, uh, it'll be uh, what's it called? Just in four by three. See, how it's just a box, like a square, and it doesn't look that great on YouTube because YouTube's widescreen and everyone loves that. So uh, I'm gonna show you how to actually change that. Like, all you need to do is record it with the settings I had it set, and then uh see and then after you render it how I tell you to uh, it'll look like this see I rendered it in 720p and it's an uh... it's in full widescreen and looks pretty good so yeah uh, all you need to do to do this is uh, open up Vegas Pro 10 or 11 doesn't matter and then uh, let's see you get your file, see your normal recorded file, drag it in there. Ah, oh, crap, not there. Okay, my bad. Yeah, now you want to drag it in here. Okay. And you click and drag it down here. Um you can see the properties uh... you do disable resample and then you go to media uh... you can uh... pause the video and see what i want but uh... you have to change this first see how it says pixel aspect ratio it's gonna be square which is what it is right here see how that's how it's gonna show up in youtube like that's cut off which no one really likes that so you can uh what to call to fix that you right click go to properties see disable your sample go to media the pixel exit uh, ratio you go to HDV 1080 which is the uh, best it can be and then you don't need to touch any other of this uh, just click OK see how it stretches it out and it doesn't look bad and then uh these render options I have right here, HDV 720, 30p, the 1280 by 720, the 29 FPS. This doesn't matter right here, uh, I don't know, don't mess with that. And you can just uh, change this to best, go to Gussing, Blend Folds, uh, and then you want to click Start All New Projects in this, because this is just for 720p, but if you want 1080p, you just... Uh, 
go down here it's 1080p uh, 24 frames see right there and then uh, the audio just copy it okay that I don't know what that is but you can just make sure it's the same yeah okay Let's see it's full screen and then uh, for rendering uh, I made a template watch yeah see custom template so you can uh, just go to create new template or wherever make sure it's like this uh, see here name it S720 or 1080 whichever one you're gonna do and make sure it's all like this see and then the video that's just audio video see that's 1280 by 720 that's uh, 720p and then for 1080p is 1440 by 1080 see that's how you can tell which one so for 720 you click that one and then Windows Media 9, CBR, whatever that is. Uh, keep it right there, 29 frames, that's good. The bit rate, uh, you can just leave that alone. Index, don't really need to do anything, and that's good. Uh, yeah, and then you just, uh, okay, see, and then once you're in a custom, you click the save, once you save it, so I already have mine, the YouTube and then the 1080 and 720. So what you do is you render it however, in whichever one you want to do. And then you just uh, leave this checked, make sure the none of the other ones are checked, and then you click save. You can change the name right here to whatever, like uh, test. But uh, I don't need to do that because I already rendered it. So once you're done, it's gonna look like this. See, uh, you can tell uh, that's just a square and that's like a rectangle, white screen. See, it's the uh, same exact video. Let me play them side by side. I'm trying to fit it to how like YouTube kind of looks like. Okay, that's about it. And then, okay, crap. I can't play them both at the same time, but you can see like in YouTube's display box it's cut out just a box see I'm just shooting zombies and then in the rendered one this is 720 by yeah 720p that's why it stretches out it won't do that in YouTube but see just shooting zombies right there it looks pretty good like I don't know it's one thing about me like uh, I don't like it being not HD because like I like have HD TVs and I love them, so I don't know. It, it it looks a lot more better, so yeah. Like, yeah. If this video has helped you, uh, please comment, rate, subscribe, and thanks for watching. Bye.